and welcome to SCW Steve Chats Wrestling right here on YouTube.com. Thank you for choosing this channel and choosing this video. Uh, maybe you can subscribe right now and check out the channel as well. There's lots of videos on there to keep you entertained. Podcasts are plenty as well. So uh, all the breaking news is on this channel. Do make sure to check it all out. Now, um, there's been backstage talk still that um, uh, WWE and uh, Vincent Mann um, are still interested in doing Shield versus the club. Um, it's still something they want to do going forward. But um, obviously, it's not going to happen right now with the idea that uh, Dean Ambrose, Seth Rollins and Roman Reigns are in a triple threat match for Battleground. They seem to be in the middle of a feud altogether. That doesn't mean they can't come back together in a few months from now. So uh, there is potential that it could happen down the line. It might be sooner than what we think. Uh, also, though, that uh, Vince McMahon would like the club to be booked stronger. Uh, perhaps there's been some poor bookings so far, but like them to seem really creditable going into this. So this means as well that the, the club and AJ Styles clearly are going to get a good run going forward if this is going to happen. There is also rumours as well that um, they could bring in uh, some new star power um, to the group as well. Shinsuke Nakamura is one name that's been mentioned, uh, as well as Samoa Joe as well has been another one that's been mentioned that could be brought into the club. But uh, Finn Balor seems like a likely candidate. And of course, uh, if you can have someone join the club now, it's got to be Finn Balor for me. I think personally it's the only way to go for that one. Um, I'll give a little bit of an opinion really with Samoa Joe. I think he would be good for the, for the club. I think he could be uh, creditable in that group. Shinsuke Nakamura, it would be an interesting way to bring him in. Um, I mean, he would be protected as well, so it could be a clever way to bring him in because I have this fear that he's going to be like Cesaro if he comes in because uh, he's he has got some skill on the mic and charisma. There's no doubt about that. His in-ring work is incredible, but I'm just not convinced that WWE would book him right on the main roster right now. So I'm kind of happy at the moment that he's in NXT and probably going to dominate the NXT brand, at least for the short term anyway. But we'll see what happens with that. But I mean, Survivor Series could be a candidate for this match. Uh, that's rumoured anyway, so we'll have to wait and see if it does develop. But the Shield versus the Club, is it something you want to see? Do you want to see it in an elimination style match? Do you want to see it in like a war games? How would you want to see this match at all? Let me know in the comment section. And uh, remember, you're watching SCW right here on YouTube.com. I want to see it. I'm not sure if it makes sense to do it right now. In the future, maybe. Um, I definitely think they need to sort this all out. And the big question as well we have to throw out is, would all these guys be on the same brand then if they're going to make this happen? Because um, we're not expecting cross uh, matches once these brand splits and these drafts are set for Raw and SmackDown. Could they all be about to be on Monday Night Raw? Time will tell. It's going to be very exciting stuff indeed. I'm very excited to see where this draft is going to play out. But uh, let me know your thoughts now on uh, SCW right here on YouTube.com. Thank you for choosing the channel and do subscribe right now.